Blind Wiki, Venice Biennale 2017. My name is Mario. I'm doing a doctorate in design at the U of University in Venice. I've lived in this city for 11 years and worked for the university since I got my BA. In my opinion, BlindWiki is forging a community inside the city, a self-regulated community with their noble aim of promoting accessibility and building something together. It stitches a fabric of people who know one another. Anna says, culturally speaking, this is a crucial initiative since it depicts a diverse city. Not the city tour guides describe, not the city people want us to see, but the city seen from the point of view and attention to detail of people who don't see. As you walk through the city's narrow streets and wide squares, it's completely unlike a normal city. Your body can feel it, but can't describe it. But that's exactly what we are trying to do. My name is Sandra and I work at the Marciana Library in Venice. That's why I got in touch with the Blind Wiki project and I immediately got involved in it. I wondered how other people, particularly the blind and visually impaired, use a different lens to see what everyone else sees with distracted eyes. I wanted to see what tags they used. Anna says, the most interesting aspect has been rediscovering some details of my home city I had forgotten, even going to see them again, touch them again. I put my finger on a part of my city that I had forgotten. Mario says, I think the first thing you need to do is listen, especially people who can see both the city and these places. That will help you truly understand what you can altruistically offer to the blind. Anna says, it's a bridge between two completely different words that rarely collaborate. Andrea says, Blind Wiki reminds me a little bit of Calvino's book Invisible Cities. It's a bit like Marco Polo, describing the city Kublai Khan will never see, leading him to listen to the stories his ambassador shares with him. I think it's a chance for everyone to participate, regardless of their age, social class, condition, abilities or disabilities. It's exciting because the project is open to everyone, so everyone can get involved, network, meet lots of new friends. That's what it's been for me. It makes you feel like you are part of something much bigger than yourself. Mario says, I really hope everyone will keep it alive. It doesn't have to be on the app, but I hope new relationships can develop from the social fabric it has created. Julia says, participating in this project made me realize that we are all people. We are not just sighted, blind or volunteers. Rather, we all have something to share. Sandra says, this is a meeting point, a forum without borders. Andrea says, this is not the end. I'm sure we'll all meet again. Mario says, Blind Wiki is a community. Anna says, it's a discovery, a never-ending discovery. Julia says, long life, Blind Wiki.